Oh, good morning. Good afternoon. It's, uh, I think, 3 o'clock or so on Sunday, September 29th. It's Fred's birthday. And we took my sister to the airport so she could fly home this morning. And now we're just chilling at home. Fred's checking email. I'm going to turn my computer on finally for the day. And we're going to just relax at home and then go out for dinner later with the kids. So I'll bring you with me when I can. Wait. I'll be back. Everybody say happy birthday to Fred. Happy birthday, Fred. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna go out for dumplings later. Yes. Right? Dumplings, yeah. yeah dumpling. With the kids. It's, um, what's the name of the place? Din Tai Fung. Din Tai Fung. It's his birthday, and uh, this last Monday was our daughter's birthday. Yep. So yeah. we're gonna, gonna go celebrate. Yep, all right, we'll be back. Good morning for like five more minutes. <laughs> we are, Bob is off today. You hear that? That's Lily, because we created her, because we're going O-U-T. We need to go to the grocery store and stuff. So she's gonna have to stay here. Lily, no! She's not happy about it. <laughs> um, anyway, so we're gonna go do that and run some errands really quick, and then come home and just, I guess, hang out with her. We have her until Thursday, so anyway. She's not happy about being in the box. We'll be back. I don't think you're gonna be able to see it unless you're good at finding Waldo. But there's a deer back there. I would say good morning everybody, but it's actually evening because I forgot to vlog this morning. Oops. 
So it's just after 6 p.m. Tuesday evening, October 1st. We've started the new month in my creative year. I got some business, a little bit of business stuff done some morning at, at this morning and some art, but we have Lily Bean again, so she's a handful. It's like having a couple of toddlers in the house. So anyway, we're gonna take her for our evening walk and try to burn off some energy before we sit down to eat dinner. Maybe, it'll work. We can only hope. All right, I'll be back. We didn't get very far. She did her business, but we're gonna try and, well, burn off some energy still. All right, we'll be back. Take this too. He's not a big Lily, or she's not a fan of Lily. Hey guys, it is Wednesday afternoon, 1.15 p.m. We are still Lily sitting. She's impatiently waiting over there for me. She, the floor in here is too cold and hard for her. She'd rather be on the couch with me, but I got shit to do. <laughs> um, anyway, I'm editing the vlog because I didn't get it done yesterday because I was, it's like having a toddler in the house or two. <laughs> so I just was too busy getting the few things done I did get done and being with her. Um, yeah, so it's a thing. Anyway, uh, so I'm getting it done now and I'll load it directly to YouTube live. I won't schedule it out or anything as soon as I get it done. Um, as you'll see in this week's vlog, if you wa are watching this clip, you're going to see the other clips. The coyotes have been by a lot this week. Um, I may not include all the clips of them coming by. Um, I may speed them up. I don't know yet until I sit and edit the vlog. But just trust me when I say that since we first saw them the other night, they've been by every day, every night since then. So um, I'm a little concerned about my neighbor's cats but they're not my cats. I did send my neighbor a message, an email message. I do believe they're still out of town, but I told them the coyotes, I've seen them, they're in the neighborhood, they're wandering around my driveway, they're looking at your yard and your fence, they're looking for your cats. Um, we also had a raccoon by the other night that looked like it was he was limping, and I think I said in the vlog here already at some point that we heard animals fighting in the woods. Um, if I didn't, we heard animals fighting in the woods. When we got home from the celebratory uh, birthday dinner for uh, my husband and our daughter, we thought it was maybe two raccoon, raccoons fighting in the trees or something. And then a couple nights later, we saw a raccoon crossing the driveway to the front porch. They like my front porch, I don't know. Um, anyway, they were crossing and he was limping, or she. So... I don't know if it was from the fight or the coyotes trying to get it or I don't know. So I am keeping an eye on Lily. I'm not letting her out alone into the backyard unless she's got to go to the bathroom. 
And um, when we go walking with her, we're cautious because we haven't just seen them at night. We've seen them in broad daylight. So that's the thing. And I think that's it for the moment. Um, I haven't gotten any inspiration journal pages done yet today or a paper clip. Um, but I will do at some point and um, right now I'm just trying to get the vlog edited and lo rendered which it's rendering right now um, and then loaded to YouTube so once that's done I can focus on the table so anyway that's where we're at today I'll be back Okay, it's way past time for me to go get the mail, but I did get my inspiration journals done in a paper clip and some paperwork and stuff like that. While I was doing all that, the ring doorbell security system thing kept going off and I just figured it was the cat, you know, Bambi's back. So if I can't go catch some footage of Bambi by the mailbox because they went around the corner towards that way, then I'll put some security footage in next. All right, I'll be back.
Okay, now there's two of them. Hang on, Lily's fascinated. There was another one. Where'd it go? I don't know where it is. That's the mommy. The other one was the baby. They're eating my bushes. Lily is so funny. She wants to know why she can't go out and play with Bambi. She's been crying. She's hilarious. She sees them out there and she starts crying because she wants to go play with her friends. See, there she is again. She can hear the ring um, security system go off too, the jingling. She knows what that is. She knows that means there's somebody in the front yard or something. Good morning. It is... I almost said Wednesday. It's Thursday, October 3rd, I think. I think it's the 3rd. Pretty sure? Okay, a little bit sure. Um, it's 9.36 a.m. I am getting ready to go. Obviously, I'm in the car. I'm going to go run some errands. We still have Lily. Uh, she gets picked up tonight. Um, I, I really have to go run errands. So, uh, she's in the crate. She doesn't like doing that. She doesn't like when people, her people leave her. That's what she doesn't like. Um, she doesn't mind being in the crate. But anyway, um, she's going to have to do it. Because I can't take her to the grocery store. <laughs> so I need to go to the grocery store. I need to go to Target. I need to drop off Etsy orders. I need to run by the new dentist and drop some paperwork off. It's just, it's, it's got to get done. So I'm going to go do that really quick and I'll be back. I do want to say to you all that we've been here in Oregon for a year. And... We moved from a city of about 2 million to a city of just over 50,000. To say that it's a big adjustment is an understatement and I'm still getting used to it. I just had a stranger driving into the place where I drop off my mail and have my P.O. box um, wave at me just for no reason. <laughs> I'm still getting used to it. All right, I'll be back. Friday, October 4th, 9.25 a.m. Don't get excited. Um, <clears throat> the lighting is a little weird, although it's 9.25 a.m. because it is cloudy and overcast in Portland today. I live in Portland, so it's that way a lot. In case you haven't noticed, the lighting is weird a lot. Um, anyway, um, Lily went home last night and all is quiet here in the house this morning. I got my posts done this morning that I need to do. I got some ske things scheduled out on Facebook. I needed to do that too. And uh, I've had, 
I've had my two cups of coffee. I kind of want a third, but I probably ought not to do that. Um, I have some art things to do. I do have an appointment this afternoon. I've got to take care of, and my mom is waving to me on Facebook. That usually isn't a good sign. Anyway, I've got an appointment this afternoon, so I've got some things I want to get done before I do that. And I think the kids might be coming for dinner tonight, or we might be grabbing a pizza with them or something. I don't know yet. So anyway, I'm going to go get it done, and I'll be back. And by the way, if you're watching this clip, you've seen the clip of the young buck that was by this morning looking for food. So one of the things I want to do this morning is put out some corn for them, because I think the bowl is empty again. All right, I'll be back. Okay, so it's after 12. I think it's about 12.30. I got all the art stuff today that done that I wanted to get done. Um, I have a quick errand to run, and then I have to... Um, I have a meeting appointment at 2.30 uh, with the kids, and it's... Uh, I'm just there as backup and support. No, nothing is wrong. I don't want to share what's going on yet until we know for sure it's going to happen, but anyway. Um... Because it is a business sort of a meeting, I probably ought to comb my hair and put on a little makeup. Just, you know, so I don't look like a hag. It's probably a good idea. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to go get my errands done and maybe dishes if I'm so motivated before I leave. Maybe. All right, I'll be back. You know, I'm home alone. Nothing is on. I'm hearing voices behind me. I'm like, what the freaking hell scared the crap out of me? Freaking uh, yahoo.com, their search page, ads, autoplay ads. Really? Holy cow. Uh, hey guys, it is Saturday, October 5th? Yes. 5th. Ha, ah, got it right. Ha <laughs> ha. It's a miracle. Um, it's 2.45 p.m. and we haven't been doing anything this morning. <laughs> We've just been chilling at home and relaxing. It's been kind of a crazy week. Um, and my knee is hurting again, so, you know, that's a thing. It's hell getting old. Anyway, we're headed out right now to the library and uh, that kind of thing. Just some quick, short, cheap errands. Free errands. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we're going to have, a, hopefully, a good time. It's a nice sunny Portland day uh, for a change for fall is very different usually it's very rainy so we're gonna enjoy the sunshine while we can and we'll be back Yeah, so how cool is this? We're sitting on a little walking pathway that's behind Michael's that we I've seen every time I come over here and we haven't walked it. I don't know we're going to get too far today because my knee is hurting, but it is set up to timeline the Ice Age. Mm -hmm. yeah. And they have like replicas of dinosaur bones and uh, footprints of like mastodons and humans and sloth. So I'm going to take what pictures I can and um, we're going to have to come back when my knee is better because this is cute. I'll, I'll be back. That's a mastodon footprint. Here's another one. So we just put some books we got at the library store in the little oh, community library box. The, the, 
hold on, the car doesn't like the fact I don't have my seatbelt. Um, anyway, so we put some books we got at the commun at the library. I, they were 50 cents each. I bought a handful of books and we put them in the community library box by the park where we usually walk. So anyway, we're gonna head home now because it's time for dinner. Oh, prom photos. <laughs> Anyway, we'll be back. Hey guys, so it is the end of the evening on Saturday. What day did I say it was? <laughs> the 5th of October. Uh, I think, anyway, it's like 10.38 or something p.m. Um, it's been a long day. It's been a good day, but a long day. I think I said earlier that my knee is bothering me. If I didn't, by the way. <laughs> I, have a, I have a brace on my leg. My knee is bothering me. Um, it's nothing serious. I've been doing a lot of walking lately. Um, it's my way of getting exercise. I like walking. Um, but I am not a spring chicken anymore and have tendonitis and arthritis in all my joints. And my left knee is periodically not happy with me. So it's nothing. Just resting it a little bit won't cure. Taking some joint supplements wrapping it with a knee brace that my friend Vicki Brown sent me. Thank you so much, Vicki. Um, and uh, yeah, it'll be good as new, despite the fact that it was hurting. I did a little walking today anyway, as you saw if you're watching this clip. Um, I can't wait till my knee is better and I have something besides flip-flops on. That didn't help. Um, and we can go on that walking path. Evidently, it's a very long path that goes all the way around the city, so that would be really fun. Anyway, it's all good, and uh, yeah, it's all good. Um, so my niece, the new mom, and her baby, she um, had um, some minor, well, she had some complications, and I won't go into it because it's personal information, but she's doing better, and she's home, and Paxton, is my new great-nephew, is doing great. Um, the new little family is just doing wonderful, and he's just the cutest little thing on the planet. Um... And I'm slowly chugging along getting projects done. I was designing some stencils earlier and working on a couple of other projects. I think I have a new line of stencils I'm going to make and I think it's going to be in conjunction with a series of YouTube videos, tutorials that you don't necessarily have to have the stencils to do, but they would be handy. That's all the hints I'm going to give you. I also think I came up with a new um, merch design for some shirts and things in a couple of different colors that I think is funny and snarky and it's rude, but you know, <laughs> I'm okay with rude. So anyway, um, I'll be working on that this week too. So look for that in um, the coming weeks. And I think that's it for right now. I'll leave any rel relevant links in the description below. And if there's any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave a comment on the video and I will respond to you. I do check my comments every day. Um, if you want to follow me on social media, shop in my Etsy shop, um, put something in my PayPal tip jar, uh, shop in my Amazon affiliate store, any of that stuff to support the free content here on YouTube, or just follow me on social media, uh, send me happy mail, anything like that. Check out the links and things in the description below uh, because there are ways to do that. There is a very long list of uh, places to find me, shops to support me in, on the Linktree listed links, which is in the video description, so check it out. Um, if you're a member of A Life of Art and Self-Expression or My Creative Year, um, do post what you're working on and um, let's start a conversation. That's it for right now. I hope you've all had a great week. I hope the next week and the coming weeks as we get closer to the crazy insane holidays are good for you. And uh, go out and have a great day. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'll see you later. Bye, guys. Bye.